Hey, what's up, guys? It's Kaushik here, and today, guys, welcome to my full detailed GK mod review of the Redmi Note 10 Pro Max. So this is the Redmi Note 10 Pro Max right in my hand, guys, and I have been using GK mod now like for two days, and I have clicked a couple of camera samples. Also, in this video, guys, we will be comparing the photo clicked with the GK mod to the stock camera app. So this will be a side by side comparison of a single picture which will be clicked with, uh, which has been clicked with both uh, the stock. MI UI camera app and Gcam mod at the same exact time. So in this side by side comparison you will get to know whether stock camera app is better or Gcam mod is better and if uh, Gcam mod really does make a difference in the picture quality or not. So do watch the complete video till the end so that you can get a better idea and guys just like always make sure you hit that red subscribe button down below as well as turn the notifications on so that you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. With that being said Let's roll the intro and get the video started. So guys starting with the video uh, going on to before going on to the camera samples I would like to say as to which version of Gcam mod I'm using. So the version which I am using is Gcam mod version 7.3. So guys if you know anything about Gcam mod then the latest version is Gcam mod 8 and 8.1 which is also available for the Redmi Note 10 Pro Max but the problem which i have noticed is that with which that uh, Gcam mod 8 or 8.1 uh, the picture quality is really inconsistent in some scenarios the picture is just apps terribly bad so i wouldn't recommend you guys to install Gcam mod version 8 or 8.1 on the Redmi Note 10 Pro Max rather go for Gcam mod 7.3 which i have used uh, to click this picture which you will see further in the video guys so uh, if you want to download this gcam mod version 7.3 you will find a link in the description down below so do download it from there so that you can also have a better picture clicking experience but uh, nonetheless guys uh, now moving on before moving on to the camera samples again Uh, I would like to talk about this Gcam mod version 7.3. So the the reason to get this Gcam mod 7.3 is because it is a old version of Gcam, and also it is pretty stable. And uh, one more uh, positive thing or plus thing which this one has is that it has its own config files. So with that config files, you can get some better results in the picture quality. So that is the reason I have gone for Gcam mod version 7.3. but uh, nonetheless guys now going on to the side by side camera comparison on your screen guys as you can see now this is the first camera sample that we have and on the left side of the screen we have the photo click with the gcam mod and on the right side of the screen you have the photo click with the stock mi ui camera app and below on that right side photo you can see the watermark of redmi note 10 pro max as well but nonetheless starting with the camera comparison guys in this first photo again this is a indoor photo which i have clicked and uh, uh, the reason to click this photo is just to check as to how both the phones uh, like both the apps do shadow processing basically in both the photos you can see in the darker section of the photo especially near the pillar you can see a lot of details uh, in the stock camera apps photo so that photo is a bit better in terms of exposing shadows as compared to the gcam mod in gcam mod it has crushed the shadows quite a bit like uh, near the pillar if you see in the dark section of the photo but other than that uh, the colors are pretty good i would say like uh, both the colors look really good the gcam photo looks a bit more contrast and has uh, some saturation to it whereas the stock camera photo looks pretty natural and bland i would say so that's to do with the first photo going on to the second photo guys uh, this is an outdoor photo again and uh, in this photo again i have clicked it to see how well the shadow has been exposed so in this you can see near the plants in the dark section of the photo when i zoom in in the gcam photo especially uh, the details are missing like the shadows have been completely crushed and uh, they have not been very well exposed whereas in the stock camera photo again if i zoom in near the plant section here you can see that the shadows and the like shadows is basically the dark section of any picture so that have been very well exposed the plants uh, there are not a lot of details but at least you can see some details more compared to the gcam mod photo so uh, other than that uh, the colors uh, if you ask me then the colors look pretty same and the color temperature of the gcam photo is a bit warm here compared to the stock camera photo now going on to the third photo guys uh, in this photo if you see they look almost identical there is not a lot of difference present in both of these photos uh, the gcam photo uh, yes it does have a bit more contrast but that is how gcam 
uh, mod uh, like it is a characteristic of gcam mod so that's how the photos uh, every time has been processed but uh, the fo both the photos look equally good and if you ask me personally i like the photo clip the gcam mod here going on to the fourth photo guys uh, this was uh, i clicked it to see the saturation levels because uh, previously in my uh, camera full review full re full camera review of the redmi note 10 pro max what i said is that uh, the photos were too saturated but now in this uh, photo you can see the gcam mod photo has done quite a lot of saturation like, like uh, the colors are very bright and vivid whereas in the stock camera photo if you see the colors look pretty natural and uh, they have not been pumped like the saturation is kept normal but in the gcam photo it is a bit uh, punchy the colors are really punchy but uh, if you ask me then i like the photo clip with the gcam mod here because it looks more lively due to that colors and this colors don't look uh, very overdone like they are also normal i would say so in this uh, i like the photo clip with the gcam mod going on to the fifth photo guys uh, i click this photo because uh, just to show you guys and demonstrate that the color temperature difference which we get to see in especially outdoor photos so this is an outdoor photo and in both the photos you can clearly see side by side like the gcam mod photo has a warm color temperature whereas the stock camera photo has a cool color temperature so that's the only difference and if you ask me about the details after zooming in to both of these photos then the details are actually uh, equally good in both of them and shadows are also really good i wouldn't say bad in any of these photos so yeah the color temperature is the only difference in this fifth photo going on to the sixth photo guys this is a night side photo which i have clicked and uh, in this photo you can uh, directly see like the gcam mod night side photo is way better than the stock camera's night side photo so both of these photos have been clicked with night side in the respective camera apps guys uh, so in this clearly the winner is gcam mod like uh, it uh, you can see it for yourself also guys like the night side photo of gcam looks really good it has very less noise and shadows are also like the dark section of the photos are also very well lit i would say and in the stock camera photo everything has been crushed everything has been dimmed out i would say but uh, yeah that should do with the night side and going on to the seventh photo here are two selfies which i clicked and uh, in both of the selfies if you can see side by side on the left side we have the photo selfie clicked with the gcam mod on the right side we have the selfie clicked with the stock camera app uh, you can clearly see if you look at my face that the stock camera app does uh, quite a bit of smoothing a uh, face smoothing to smoothen out all the irregularities on your face all the black spots and everything of that kind and whereas the gcam photo has a lot of details into it it doesn't do over smoothing it keeps it pretty natural and pretty sharp with a lot of details on your face so this is up to your personal preference guys like if you like high detailed selfies then you can definitely go with the gcam mod whether and if you like uh smoothened out uh like brightened out faces kind of that kind of look then you can definitely click selfies with the stock camera app so now that you guys have seen the camera samples of both the gcam mod and the stock camera app side by side you guys now have a better idea as to which app performs better but then too if you ask me my opinion then what i think is that uh, both the camera apps the gcam mod and the stock miui camera app does perform equally good i wouldn't say one is better than other because the results were pretty consistent and pretty same the only difference with the gcam mod was that uh, it is clicking a bit warm pictures for some reason i don't know usually that doesn't happen with the gcam mod but this is an early release or build i would say of gcam mod soon it will be also updated to the latest gcam mod 8 and it will also get better with time but nonetheless uh, the results are pretty same and pretty consistent uh, with the gcam mod it will click a bit warm pictures and the saturation will also be up as well as the contrast so that the picture looks really good and in the side of stock camera app it also clicks really good pictures shadows sometimes it exposes really better compared to gcam mod so yeah that's about it and both the apps are really good you can definitely definitely go for the gcam mod to gain some extra percentage of picture quality or uh, it's up to you guys so i would recommend you guys to go with the gcam mod version 7.3 it's given in the description down below so feel free to download there and uh, also i'll be making a video of gcam mod version 8 soon for the redmi note 10 pro max as the, we get a stable release of gcam mod 8 i will definitely do make a video of that uh so yeah that's about it guys for this video i hope you have liked this camera this uh camera app comparison between the gcam mod and the stock camera app 
and if you do then please hit the like button down below guys and also do consider subscribing to my channel by hitting that red subscribe button down below as well as turn the notification on guys because a lot of redmi note 10 pro max content is coming to the channel really really soon with that being said this is your boy kaustubia from tech to explore signing off until then keep exploring